Hello. So for those of you who don't know, basically everyone on the internet, my name is Alyssa Tiquai, and in today's video, it's sort of TikTok, YouTube-ish inspired. Now I know a lot of people with long hair have been putting like a bunch of hair ties in and making it into a tree and I kind of wanted to do that. I have insanely long hair and I'm really afraid I don't have enough hair ties. I only have like this many so it's probably not going to work but I'm going to try and if I run out and maybe I can use pre-wrap to stick my hair up into a tree and then since since this is vlogmas and I wanted to do something Christmassy themed, I have a bunch of this sort of cheap-ish garland that I got from the dollar store and I wanted to see if I could use it to create like a Christmassy tree and hello. Sorry, that's my dog sniffing the camera if you hear any sniffles. So I'm gonna try as best as I can to see if I can make that and I really hope it works out because I think it would be super cool to have my hair as a Christmas tree. <laughs> so anyways, let's get into it. All right, so I'm moving into the corner so you don't see all the stuff in the background. That's all the cotton from the Santa video yesterday and let's get into it, I guess. So first rubber bands. This is like the most important one, right? This is like our tree stand, I guess. I'm also wearing, I'm also wearing a green sweater, which I got from Goodwill, so I could sort of blend in with the tree. And oh my gosh, these are, you know hair ties when you haven't really worn them on your wrist and they're not stretched to like your hair's thickness? That's what all of these are right now. So I really hope that they don't snap on me because that would kind of hurt. Okay. So, I have one. Beautiful, I feel just like my sports golden years. <laughs> okay, so I have two and I'm already feeling like this is gonna be really hard because I have pretty like thick curly hair and some of them just really don't wanna shove like into all these hair ties. So I'm just trying my best to kind of like force it, I guess. <laughs> that sounds really bad, but yeah, hopefully it goes okay. I feel like maybe I should have added something to for extra support, but I don't got that time. I've already committed. It's going down. Okay, you can sort of see some progress, and I even have green hair ties. I feel so festive. <laughs> What if like in my youth I showed up to a softball or like a basketball game and I had tree hair like, hello, my name is Stacy. <laughs> I think that's like a weapon that I shouldn't be able to use in sports. What if, what if I was able to get like so much farther in my sports career because I had hair like this? Man, I was just behind on the times, man. Like, who knows? Maybe I would be like a professional soccer, softball, basketball, swimming, person if I was able to do this to my hair who would have thought think of all the possibilities where my life would have taken me all right I'm on my last hair tie which is already a bummer but I've gotten pretty far already I think hopefully hopefully the pre-wrap will work I know when I played sports that I used this and if I didn't have a hair tie I'd just kind of like roll it up and put it in my hair and I know that it'll be a lot harder to take out, but hey, that's not the part you guys are watching, right? This is for pure entertainment. Okay, you can see my tree. It's made some significant progress. I put in the pre-wrap for the first time. As you can see the top, it actually works pretty well. Now, I feel like my tree sort of sticks up, but not really, so it kind of like sways from side to side. I don't know how to put any sort of fortification on it. Um, I'm just gonna try my best and hopefully finish the rest and see how it turns out. <laughs> Sorry you can't like really see all of it. I'll have to go to the bathroom and show you when it's like done because my tripod just isn't tall enough for this. I'm not a professional YouTuber. <laughs> all right, let's keep going. All right, check it in. Whoop, <laughs> Look, okay, now, okay. I gotta go down here. I just have the ends left and that's it. Oh my God, it looks beautiful. I look like a who Christmas tree or like, I don't know, some sort of Christmas tree that's in Whoville or the Lorax. 
Oh, the Lorax! Yeah, those like fuzzy, fuzzy, those fuzzy like pink ones with the long stem and or trunk or whatever. <laughs> oh my God, what am I saying? But yeah, I just look like the brown haired version, I guess that can't really stick up. No wonder they want to cut them all down. <laughs> okay, gotta keep going, check in with you later. All right, I think I'm done with my tree. Oh my God, this is like a good arm's length. Let me see if I can go to the bathroom and show you guys. Oh my God, I am an angler fish. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> like if, just imagine a light bulb at the end of my hair and this is how I attract my prey. Didn't, didn't, didn't. What if I went to the bars like this? Like, hey, you trying to meet up? You like my hair? You like my cool little height? Hi, um. I've become a man-eater. <laughs> oh my god, and I'm an anglerfish. Oh, but to use this as a weapon in sports? Like, this is terrifying. Or maybe I should just put my hair up like this all the time in case someone ever tries to like, whoop -a. I'll be ready, I can just whip him with my hair. Is this what Willow meant when she said I whip my hair back and forth? Like, dude, that is a legitimate weapon. Holy. All right, let me see if I can go show you in the bathroom. This is how long it turns out to be. It's almost to my ceiling, and look how tall it is. Okay, I don't really know how people like on TikTok and stuff get theirs to stay up, or maybe my hair is just like too long that it can't stay up fully on its own. But yeah, this is gonna be a super cute Christmas tree when it's all said and done. Now that I have my face, hello? Yes, this is Alyssa. Who is this? <laughs> oh my gosh, it's like a telephone. Wow, this thing is so versatile. I love it. Oh, I could be like a crooked halo or something or I don't know. Anyway, so I have some extra Christmas lights. So what I think I'm going to do is like wrap the Christmas lights around the tree base, which is my hair right now. And then I'll put some garland because what is a Christmas tree without some Christmas lights, right? So let me just plug those in Ooh, beautiful okay so let's see if I can kind of like wrap it around if this is even possible I don't know this just looks kind of insane to be honest my tree it's now decorated in lights and it has a bunch of extra but you know all right so now it's Definitely getting into the festive spirit, see? All right, now let's see if I can cover it in garland and make it even look more like a tree, sort of-ish, hair tree, you know, however you're gonna put it. I think I just need to hold it. I think that's the best bet for it because if I just put it like this, it becomes too heavy and just doesn't stay up, so yeah. I have a lot of this like dollar store garden, garland, not garden, garland, and I'm hoping that maybe two will do the trick. I don't know, but I want to like kind of cover it, but still be able to see the lights shining through. I just don't want you to be able to see my hair is the thing. So maybe if I just like hold it downward or to the side, I can still sort of see that my camera hasn't died on me and that I can kind of see what I'm doing. Oh my god, this looks so beautiful! I probably should have put like a bunch of coat hangers in my hair. I think that's what girls did on like crazy hair day in middle school, but I just didn't really think of that until now, and I don't think I have any wire coat hangers. Oh my goodness. Okay, so that's just one garland, which honestly looks pretty good, but I just want to go over it again just to make sure there are no extra like faces where you can see my hair and then maybe I could even wrap around more towards the end so it kind of looks like a triangle instead of like a Christmas toothpick voila I think we're done so this is my Christmas tree head <laughs> la, la, Copacabana. oh my goodness isn't it beautiful wait let's see if I if it can if I can lean it back so it can stand up without me holding it. Uh. Beautiful! <laughs> if I can 
take a picture of this in the bathroom and kind of, I don't know where I'm going to plug it in, but let's see how it officially looks all together. I love how you can sort of see the lights but not really and I think that it's just a great sort of aspect of the tree and it like makes it twinkle but it's not too obvious and I love how I still wrap that third garland I think that was a huge help towards the bottom because now it definitely looks more triangular and yeah that's my tree hat <laughs> I'm super excited with how this came out. I, I think this is probably a pretty dumb video, but and it's gonna be pretty short, but I love how it turned out. And if when the tree leans over, it sort of looks like that tree, I think it's in the Grinch, or is it Griswold's Christmas? I don't know, there's like a tree that's kind of bent over the side. I think it might be the Grinch, but anyway, I'm super excited with how this came out, and I love how it just kind of add something a little extra to your Christmas sweater party or outfit or you know if you needed this to be a tutorial like it's super easy to do and it doesn't take that much time and you're definitely gonna be the life of the party um the only thing is I would probably put battery lights instead of plug-in lights so you don't have to like chase all the electrical outlets and stuff but yeah I think that's it for today's video. If you liked it, make sure to give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in the next video. Merry Vlogmas. Bye. Oh, <laughs> it hit my hat. Oh, it hit my hand. Bye.